Good morning, Cancer, or good day, Cancer. This is your romance reading for July 2020, and you've come in um, in the uh, in the romance readings. You've come around uh, after uh, Taurus with 22 likes. Now, I'm glad to see you back here, my sweetie, and. If you would like to be number one, to get your reading as number one next month, then please give us the likes, um, as th the most likes will be first. This time it was Gemini and um, Gemini and uh, Capricorn and Libra. Those were the first three. Thank you very much for all your likes and shares. And welcome back, my cyber angels. I love you dearly. And of course, new people, if you've landed uh, on this channel, then it means something really specific. And welcome. And please subscribe and hit the bell on all. Then you'll be notified when I go live, as I go live on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Give away free cards, and I also answer questions. Uh, that are supported by donations and if you would like to have an extended reading then by all means send me an email you find the e uh, information below this video in the description box and also uh, in the top right hand corner in the little white circle in the screen on the screen I'm doing the nine card spread again. This is the clearing card, the overall, the overall energy. Um, I leave that up to you. Uh, week one, week two, week three, week four, and the um, uh, clarification cards on the uh, tarot cards or the tarot clarifying the Lena Mun. I'm not using the numerology or the cartomancy, just what the uh, Lena Mun picture means and what I see in that picture at that moment. I'm also using the uh, Angels Romance deck, the Surrendering deck. Um, that is just a suggestion or um, advice and an answer from the Angels. Now, um, we did have a great discussion. I went live on Friday. That was a discussion night also about the competition. The competition, nobody's entered it, so it's been called off. Um, I will be doing something later on Facebook. Um, and if you would like to join there, then please become a member and uh, you will be notified. As I also sent out notifications through Facebook before I go live and on Instagram. Also on YouTube. Uh, YouTube in the community uh, under the community button and um, as I have been told by a lot of viewers they're not getting notified so that's my extra little bit of um, help and support towards uh, all my viewers to let them know I am going live now the first card um, cancer is the ace of pentacles the Ace of Pentacles is a new beginning. So this is a romance reading, so you could start a new relationship. This relationship will be durable and for long term. Uh, it could be also um, a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. Because you've got more Pentacles in this reading than um, I have uh, had in any other reading and I think it's more of um, I'm getting the word stability stability and that uh, perhaps you are starting off um, with somebody or perhaps on your own but it is something that is stable I think you're starting off with somebody it could be an earth sign but it could also be with a Gemini as you have the lovers so that means a new love relationship is definitely on the horizon the angels seem to be blessing you look at that 
the angel is right above you and is blessing this unity it is definitely a new beginning for most of you if not all of you because there's also an ending because you've got the ten of pentacles but that is in the fourth week so I'll get to that in a minute so in the beginning of July you might meet um, a new love or somebody that you've already ma met that is an earth sign or a new love will be a um, a, a new love for long term because the pentacles stands for durability um, uh, and long term um, in the second week you are waiting perhaps some of you are not getting a new love in the first week or meeting up with a new love but you've sown the seeds okay you've sown the seeds it only takes one seed to grow and blossom and you're waiting for your harvest so in the second week you might be meeting your new lover perhaps you um, are uh, hooked up and uh, you are waiting to get pregnant or you might be waiting to buy that house well the waiting will pay off you will be harvesting this could be in the second week um, but it could also be in the first week you might part you might partner up with somebody or be partnered up with somebody and you would like to extend the family and you want to buy that house but you didn't have the money beforehand and now y you've been waiting to get the okay from the mortgage broker to get that mortgage you you are being recognized as a couple so the go ahead is yes that it could be your new beginning and that could bring more stability for both of you if you're not partnered up then you somebody has recognized how beautiful you are and that you are a hard worker and that you are a stable person cancer that you are loving passionate caring nurturing sexy and sensual come on cancer you're a typical water sign you will balance out what plants need water to grow and your water so you will make the Virgo grow okay <coughs> and you will make pick the harvest look at that you've got the ten of Pentacles it looks more like um, um, a career uh, a career reading uh, that you are enhancing your career but don't remember uh, don't forget if you enhance your career um, and you get this pay rise or this job that is a new stable beginning and it will also help you in your relationship to be stable because then you can buy that house then you can extend the family even if it's a dog or a cat you see the dog here that's also part of the family <coughs> excuse me and perhaps you might not be able to see because this is quite a busy card but you can see the dog just there there might be a baby you might find out at the end of July that you're pregnant and that your wish is coming your wish is coming true and that of your partner I think it could also be a house because you've got the house here okay that you're finally buying that house now here you are with two and here you are with three the family the bear so the pregnancy could be there is an ending 10 10 so you've got two numbers the angels have your back like here you are balanced emotionally you have the equilibrium that people seek that is when you're hooked up if you're not hooked up you will get it 
you will work towards it and you wa will wait patiently you will be steadily growing that is what pentacles means steady but sure and the bear means that somebody in around you could be jealous of you like I said that you've got such a loving and secure relationship don't worry the bear protects what he loves or what he's passionate about okay he can stand his ground and luck is on your side yes luck is on your side because you might receive a gift you might receive that loan you might even inherit or you might win some money then cancer you have the crossroads you've got lots of choices I know the road looks zigzaggy but that is life as well ups and downs we have our good moments and we have our less good moments it seems that you are getting your wish you've been working hard and you've been doing this digit <coughs> did I can't come out of my words uh, you've worked hard and you've kept on going and you've kept on believing in yourself and your relationship so you are going up you're going up now and you're finishing of a phase of being on your own you then becomes a one there is a new beginning and also the ace has confirmed that you'll be going from one to two and then to three you are being recognized somebody has an eye on you then you have the flowers and flowers also means good luck somebody might give you a gift okay the bouquet of flowers um, means that somebody might give you a gift and it's also good luck so somebody might give you a bunch of flowers or give you a ring who knows usually when the bunch of flowers comes out it's a small gift but because we've got the ten of uh, pentacles here it could be a ring translated into a ring that is very expensive it will cost a lot of money but you've been working to buy that or they have you could as well or the house of course there you go <coughs> you've been working digilent, digilently steadily and surely and you have the okay from the bank manager they can see that you have a steady routine and that you've been building up security and they can invest in you by giving you that loan so now you will most probably buy this house with your potential partner or you might be moving in with your partner or they might be moving in with you wow this is definitely a beautiful time a beautiful month for you something will be completed and come full circle very soon that's the romance of the oracle card is very soon clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now let the universe know what you want what you're wishing for if you're coupled up you might want to have that house if you're coupled up you might want to have a pet or extend your family in an other way if you don't want to get pregnant then take precautions if you can't get pregnant then it might be that uh, you might become an aunt or a godmother or a grandmother I'm trying to read here for all kinds of people thousands of people so that s you have to see what the possibilities could be now the advice card is surrender to your soul's path your life's journey has been perfectly designed for your soul's growth yes you can see the growth here and you're seeing the results as well embrace every le lesson and every moment 
and that came uh, quite strongly came out of Taurus's reading that somebody might be leaving the house and you have um, you have fulfilled your task as a parent this could be you too or your child might uh, and you fulfilled your task as a parent and you might become a grandparent if not then if you haven't got any children you might become a godmother or an aunt as there could be an extension with you or around you you might even hear of a pregnancy or a birth okay so enjoy every facet of life we learn from different facets of life and the and the angels say take action well let me put it this way how can you take action well if you hear of a birth take action and start knitting if you don't know how to knit then learn to knit it could be a new interest you if you are um, you could also be downsizing your home if you are at that stage with your partner you might be downsizing and uh, you will have money left over after selling the house you might buy and invest in something else so that you can be together more often in uh, a relaxing creative time Wow you might buy a summer house as they call it a weekend away or a boat or a caravan and so that you can be together that is the other option when you are hooked up so you've got the single person right number one just you cancer and you're coming together and you are growing you're building something that is tangible durable and for long term so enjoy every single moment of each phase there are endings 10 10 okay but it, it will be a one a new beginning again you are planting seeds in every phase of your relationship and life I know I said um, I wasn't going to do numerology but a 10 becomes a 1 and you've got a 1 here okay and a 1 1 is 11 or 2 so you've the angels have your back so the angels are giving me a message here 1 1 next to each other is 11 a new doorway the angels are giving you a new beginning so step through that doorway and take your chance it's going to be okay better than okay I would say so take action open your heart open your solar plex and open yourself for new ideas and new things are going to happen okay so take action otherwise it won't whether you are hooked up or single be with your lovey-dovey and take action be creative go and do a hob new hobby together <laughs> okay well I hope you have enjoyed this reading and I hope you uh, will pop into the live sessions like I said I go Monday Wednesday and Friday and I hope you will enjoy uh, July Take care and stay safe and please like and share the videos. If you would like to be number one, then keep on hitting those thumbs. So take care and God bless.